right now after a 11 hour day. We're going down to California to drop off a race car, race UTV, to Ultimate Arm. Gonna get the front end cut off because it's bent to rat shit. And we're gonna pick up two more, three more cars? I don't really know. But it's gonna be a good time. I'm excited. Been driving for about seven hours. We're in Redding, California. Still got like five, six more hours, seven. I don't even know. We've just been driving forever and we had to go long ass ways to get it down to LA. But I'll show you what you guys, what we're hauling. Check the straps. Oh, it's still tight. Good, good. Yeah. Still tight. Cool, cool. Awesome. Awesome. Everything's still tight. Still got a long way to drive, but... Oh, I look like a wreck. Oh my goodness. I'm on 28 hours with no sleep. We've been driving for about 12-ish hours. We're not quite at there yet, but we're at a different place getting something custom that I can't really show you guys for the YXZ. But it's been one hell of a trip. Just had to take turns and I slept, I think, 15 minutes. That's how much I slept this whole trip after a full day's work. But a lot of people were asking me what I do for work because I got a new job and I didn't really tell anybody about it. I pretty much work on side-by-sides I tear them down to complete nothing give them a gear reduction and put the transmission back and all the engine backs and everything back together as well as normal cars so I do work on normal cars trucks tractors ATVs pretty much if it has wheels I work on it it's a pretty sweet gig I actually got a pretty good deal here and uh, I enjoy every minute of it it's just it's fantastic and uh, we do build for customers and we actually get to go race for them. Like we raced against Honda and Monster and uh, I can't think of any other. We race against a lot of people and it's just a good time. And uh, I'm glad to be a part of it. It's just, I mean, it's my dream job. This is awesome. I'm trying to film and show you guys what it's like to to be where I'm at, to do what I'm doing. And it just, uh, it's kind of hard to film because a lot of stuff I can't show you guys until the customer sees it first. So we finally made it to Ultimate Arm, and uh, some of the things in here is pretty cool. I mean, he takes uh, like this smashed front end. I'll have to show you guys what it looks like inside. But pretty much takes it, cuts it off, and welds a new front end. So that way you don't have to scrap this. See, this is what I was talking about. This is the new improved. So you don't have to scrap these. You just get a new front end. Well, we got everything loaded from Ultimate Arm onto the trailer, and um, I finally got some sleep. I got like three hours sleeping on the trailer, and then um, we got everything loaded up, and we're on our way back to Oregon. And that's just all right. So we made it back to Oregon. It was a lot of fun. It was a great trip. Uh, we're gonna have to go do it again at the end of January, and we're also gonna be at King of the Hammer in I think February, I believe it is. We're going to be going to that as well, so uh, that will be, I'll try to film that as well. Um, I know with this trip there's a lot of things that I couldn't film, like I wasn't allowed to, so I did what I can, and uh, yeah, we're back in Oregon, and uh, got to start putting those cars back.